Hey everybody, I'm Nine First Warning Meteorologist Brandon Spinner. Now, as we're looking ahead to the winter, uh, the Climate Prediction Center just put out their forecast for another La Nina this winter. What does that mean? That'll make it our third year or at least third winter in a row under La Nina conditions. And right now the forecast is looking pretty high of a probability that will be in that La Nina pattern. A La Nina is when the waters in the eastern Pacific right near the equator, just a little further south, are cooler than normal. Now, the Pacific and the way those water temperatures are really help help drive the circulations in the atmosphere, not only at the surface, but in the upper levels, and that helps to steer weather patterns during seasons. As you can see, the blue bars here towards the top of the chart showing higher percentage chance that will be in a La Nina, but as we move past December, January and February and get towards the early portions of next year, looking more and more likely we turn towards a neutral season, which could change things as well. But what does a La Nina normally mean here in the tri state? Generally, a La Nina pattern means a wetter than normal winter. That would be because that polar jet stream comes down and we get that to interact with that moisture feed and flow out of the northern Pacific. And as that comes through, and we pull more moisture out of the Gulf of Mexico, we start to see that interact right here through the Ohio River Valley. But that doesn't necessarily mean we'll have more snow because we do also start to see warmer than normal temperatures in a typical La Nina season. I just dug through all the data here. Over the last 30 years, we've had 12 La Ninas. And in, in fact, six of them had a below normal snowfall, six of them had above normal snowfall. So what does that mean for us? Well, as I mentioned, this is going to be the third La Nina year in a row, and we've only had back to back or back to back to back La Ninas a few times over the last 30 years, and it'll only be the third time ever that we've had three straight La Nina winters. Well, going back through the last 30 years, I noticed that every year that was the second or third La Nina finished with below normal snowfall. So while it's still early to tell, I would say that we're likely to have a snowy season which runs from October through April with less than 23.3 inches of snow. Only time will tell, but that's where I'm going with for this year's forecast.